Honey, are you really sure you want to run for re-election as mayor? Absolutely. 100%. I don't want Mr. Torn to run unopposed and get elected mayor. Mr. Torn? You mean Max's dad? That's right. And him becoming mayor would be a catastrophe for the city. He doesn't stand a chance against you. You're the best. <laughs> Children, I'm counting on you to look after yourselves. I'm going to be very busy with this election campaign. I won't be able to spend much time with you. What's an election campaign? Well, the people who live in the city are going to decide who will be their next mayor. And the election campaign is when each candidate explains what he or she will do for the city. All I know is that Max's dad doesn't like my mom. No, that's not quite it. It's no big deal, because I don't like Max, either. Hm. Oh, hey, look at that! Wow, your mom looks great in that photo. She's got my vote. Ha. Oh, you're too young. You're not allowed to vote. That's unfair. Hmm. Hey, Elliot. Huh? My dad's gonna beat your mom because he is the biggest and strongest. Yeah, right. You wait and see. And anyway, my mom's better looking. <laughs> my dad can run the fastest. My mom's more fun. <laughs> my dad can fix anything. <laughs> I'm so happy! I really did good on that test. Me too. It was real easy. How'd you do, Elliot? It's really not fair that my worst enemy's dad is my mom's worst enemy. Don't you think Elliot's acting kind of strange? Uh-huh. Oh, no! I don't believe it! Look! Wow, she sure was looking a whole lot better this morning. Who is that? That's Mr. Torn, Max's horrible father. Oh, so that's him. Ah. Added a little mustache. <laughs> no! No way! That'll teach you to try and take me on. Soon this town will be all mine. <laughs> <laughs> Mom! Mom! Your picture is up and it looked good before, but now it looks a mess. There are scribbles and lines out of mustache. Elliot, what are you talking about? Your picture on the billboard. There's all kinds of drawings all over it. Oh, does he ever make me angry? That's no way to run a campaign. That Mr. Torn has really got himself organized. His teams are putting graffiti all over my pictures. Now, that's not very nice. We need to put a stop to this. We need to create an army and stand up against this. These kind of anti-democratic manipulations are intolerable. We must defend our rights against those who threaten them. Citizens, let's unite against the dictatorial threats weighing on our town. You've got to paste up my photo all over town, everywhere, because I'm the best. Yes, master. And make sure you tear down all the photos of Isabel Kidd. <laughs> Elliot, I've got a job for you and your friends. Michael, watch what you're doing. You're putting her upside down. Oh, sorry about that. Hey, look. Huh? Mission accomplished. Over and out. See you later, chickens. <laughs> you don't stand a chance trying to take us on. <laughs> Said on the billboard they were having a meeting at the movie theater on Saturday. What's the meeting supposed to be for? Well, Mr. Torn is going to explain to the people what he intends to do for the city. In other words, his platform. What happens at a meeting? Well, people sit in the theater and the candidate is up in front of them, on a rostrum. He often shows a film to promote his ideas. 
This kind of meeting is very important. What happens if the meeting goes wrong? If the meeting goes wrong, your mom will be elected mayor of the city. Let's not get carried away. <laughs> Mr. Torn is very good at this sort of thing. You know what you have to do. Don't you worry. We're ready. Let's do it. Go back into the theater and sit down. I'll take care of the DVD. You see what I see? Up here? Hey, come back here! Oh. What's going on here? What are you doing? Put some muscle into it. Open that door. Afterwards, you can start the film. Mr. Torn doesn't like nature. That's true. The other day, I saw him stomping out flowers in front of the town hall and on vegetables in his garden. <laughs> that was a crying shame. <laughs> That's not my film. Say, Edmund. Yes, sir. What is this? Are you kidding me? Do you think I'm paying you to make fun of me? I'll find out what's going on. The greatest person for mayor of the city is Isabel Kidd. You are all so nice, really. And I promise that I'll always take really good care of you. Well, don't watch! I forbid you! Don't look for me! I'm an awful person! Mean and nasty! <gasps> Torn son wants to hurt me! Shame on you! Huh? Stop it! Let me go! No! Don't go! I forbid you! It's not over! There was just a little glitch! We'll fix it! I wanted to make a speech! This town could ever have! Tell me. Well, if it isn't Mr. Torn, what a nice surprise. I'm warning you, you're not gonna get away with this. What you did yesterday is inexcusable. Using your children like that, shame on you. I don't know what you're talking about. Here, you can have this. I think it's yours. You'll be hearing from me. You can count it. Hmm? Go to 
jail. You boys always win. Hmm? <laughs> Elliot, did you make this film? Yeah, it was me. Wasn't it just great? The talking teddy bear was my idea. <laughs> That's not what the problem is here. And I'm the one who filmed Max making faces. Oh, right. <laughs> that was really funny. Jeremy! Elliot, what you did was inexcusable. But I must admit, it showed talent. <laughs>